Hello, and welcome to the Window Inc. Weekly for February 14th, 2024. Uh, joined today by the one and only Mr. Dennis Miller. Dennis, how are you? Good. All right. And, and so, what is today? Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day, everybody. All right. So, happy Valentine's Day. Uh, a lot to share. So, tomorrow night, uh, what's happening tomorrow night, Dennis? The football versus the staff athlete game. Yep. Uh, or well, we're going to play basketball tomorrow night yeah. at Lawrence Black. Uh, gymnasium here at the Bowling Green Community Center. Dennis and I will be there, right? So you get to call yeah. the roof for your favorite yeah. team, Dennis? Yeah, we we'll for you, Dennis, right? Thank you, Dennis. You're welcome. All right, we will love to have you come on and join us. Uh, tell us about the Wildcat Swimmers. How has swim season gone this year? It's been going good. We want to swim to get the staff, and the staff is going down. We want to win. Okay, so you're rooting for us on on. Uh, Thursday night, but yeah. next week when it's it's swim, it's it's all bets are yeah. off. All right, yeah. so uh, Wildcat swimmers will take on the board of DD staff on the twenty first at BG's Cooper Pool, uh, just before they head to the state winter games, which will be at Bowling Green State University February twenty third through the twenty fifth. All right, so Dennis, we're we're up to March's DD awareness. So we have several uh, events planned throughout the throughout the year. Uh, but in March, you know, is officially Developmental Disability Awareness Month, but here at the Board of DD, uh, we celebrate and raise awareness and educate 24-7, 365. So uh, we have SIP Shops is coming up on Thursday, February 22nd. So Dennis, what do we want people to do with SIP Shops? Come out and support us. Yeah, come on out. Uh, we would love to have that. Uh, specifically, uh, we're trying to really increase the opportunity for uh, those who are siblings of individuals with disabilities uh, to talk about uh, the challenges, but also the celebrations. And so we would love to have you. Again, Joe and Sharice have guaranteed pizza and fun. Uh, so uh, come on out for that guarantee of fun. Then how about the celebrity basketball game, Dennis? Mark Desir will play the celebrity basketball game. Let's bring it all down. Come on <laughs> out when you get to be there. Uh, so we have that's we have several local celebrities that are that are coming out, and we would love to uh, we'd love to play to a full house, uh, good or bad. We'd love to play to a full house. Uh, Dennis, are you going to be in attendance? Yes, I will be there. Cheer you on. on oh, yeah. <laughs> Dennis, I'm loving this. Thank okay. you. All right. So uh, and then how about uh, March 12th? Where are we at? March 12th, we're going down to the same house and talk to. Our Safe people. Yep, we are going to be meeting with our elected officials uh, down at the state house. It is always a, it's really just a kind of a fun day, but it's where we get to focus on uh, some of the uh, advocacy aspects that are near and dear to us. Correct? Yeah, that's right, Brian. All right, uh, and then March sixteenth, uh, we got a new event going on this year. It actually happened last year, uh, but this year uh, the. Uh, Registrations have really been strong, and so bonding through books at March 16th at the Millie venue here in Bowling Green starting at 10 a.m. Uh, if you would like to sign up, please do so, as uh, we are approaching uh, the point where uh, we're going to have to cut off registration. So looking forward to that. Uh, and then tell us about the Community Honors Banquet, Dennis. Oh, um, it's a good time in the honor thing where you get to eat and get awarded and stuff. All right, we would love we would love to have you. Details will be coming out in the very near future as we uh, plan to continue to uh, continue to develop. And then uh, we have a great announcement, right? It's cold outside, but we are thinking about the warm weather and the Wood County Fair. Uh, what is returning this year? The rain of dream. Last year I saw a rabbit. This year I'm gonna show a pig. All right. So the Ring of Dreams is making it back for a year or two. A uh, huge shout out to the Wood County Fair Board, uh, Amy Dower and, and the crew that really put it all together last year. It's coming back. And so you're already moving on, right? Moving on yeah. from a rabbit. Take, uh, moving up to a pig. To showing a pig. Yes, you? I am. All right. We are looking forward to that. Uh, and the Ring of Dreams is scheduled for Thursday, August 1st at 5.30 p.m. at this year's Wood County Fair. So certainly stay tuned for more information. Uh, we will be uh, getting that out so that we can uh, start to sign up early. Uh, any final words today? Jessica, you look pretty every day and have a Valentine's Day, Cameron and Jessica. All right, happy Valentine's Day. We'll see everybody next week.